Ryan. What's up? Techno Reviewer here. Uh, I got a guide here for you guys. Um, how to record your screen on a Mac. I usually use Snagit, but that's for a PC. It doesn't work on a Mac. Tried it. I wouldn't try it. It doesn't work too well. Mac doesn't agree with it. What you're going to want to do, open up your browser. Go to apple.com. Search in uh, Screenium. Should be the first result up here if it loads. Here we go. Um, then you're gonna want to download this. Free download. It's safe. It's Apple. It's fine, guys. Don't worry about it. I've done it. It's working. It's fine. No problems here. Um, once you got that download, I'm not gonna re-download it because I like to save space on my MacBook here. Um, once you get it, you open it up. It's gonna agree with me this time. Last time it didn't. I film this. Uh, good gracious. Hold on, guys. Sorry about that. Okay, there we go. Here we are. That's the one I just filmed because I screwed up. With it. Um, here we are. Uh, let me show you a little bit about it. It's got fixed area, full screen, mouse area, single window. It'll allow you to pick up audio, which is what I'm doing here, um, through the eyesight. It'll also allow you to film like I'm doing up here in the corner, which I'm in right now. But um, it'll f film it. You can move it anywhere you want, really. Any corner, anywhere, middle of the screen. I think you can go top right, top left, bottom right, bottom left, middle of the screen. I prefer top left. It's nice and out of the way. Um, Here, jump to library. It'll just jump you to the library after you finish filming, whatever. Um. Display recording area fixed. You can make it move or whatever. I don't know. And then the keys to start filming. I use uh, the asterisk. I don't know. No, it's not an asterisk. I don't know. A little wavy thing. I don't know what it's called. I use that to start. And I use tab to stop. Because you want to use something you don't use too often. Because you'll start filming randomly. And it's annoying sometimes. So you can set a timer. Like I probably should have limited this one for uh, 10 minutes for YouTube. But I didn't. I don't know why. Hotkeys, you can set these up. I don't know how to use these, honestly. Like, like there's all these complicated little keystrokes that I have no idea how to do. Like, I don't know what the arrow is. I don't know what this is. I don't know what any of these are. Like, I, arrow. I don't know what those are, actually. I'm not even going to try. I'm going to embarrass myself trying to do that. Then library, again. Pick out what you're filming, full screen, mouse area, whatever, and when I click, you're going to notice, like I can't see it right now, but it's going to do little ripple things, which will just show you where it's clicking. You can turn that on or off. Right now, it's let me record in um, high definition HD, so that's a plus for you guys, because that is really nice. 24-bit pixel, uh, 1280 by 800, that's HD right there. You can compress it differently, however you want. I don't know. I haven't played around with the settings. Custom, maybe. I don't know what that is. Ooh, wow. Oh. You can set it as a photo. Quality. Best. Whatever. You know. You know how that all goes. Should have been doing best, but whatever. Um, again, snag it. You, you're, it's a demo version, what you're going to download, so you're going to need a uh, key code. I have a key code, guys, but I'm not going to release it willy-nilly because of the legal reasons I mean if you're a subscriber and you hit me up with an email a PM something I mean I'll, I'll definitely give you the key code but for right now I'm not gonna post it on this video or in the sidebar or on my channel or anything you gotta be a subscriber to get that key code um that's about it for this it's a great program records in HD nice for a Mac safe looks nice I don't know. Good, uh, good program. I give it a 9 out of 10. Alright, see you guys. Peace out.